How to survive a Komodo dragon attack Knowing how to survive a Komodo dragon attack can help save your life. But encountering these dragons can be terrifying. They are the world's most giant, potent, and dangerous lizards. Listen and learn how to survive a Komodo dragon attack. Komodo dragons, are a type of lizard that have solid muscles and shark-like teeth. They are the heaviest and most giant lizards on earth. Adult Komodo dragons can weigh more than humans, as they can tip the scale around 150 to 200 pounds. They can also be longer than an average person, as a male Komodo dragon can stand 8.5 feet tall. You may find Komodo dragons in Indonesia. They live on five islands in the southeastern part of the country. 1. Gili Motang. 2. Komodo. 3. Gili Dasami. 4. Rinka. 5. Flores. Komodo dragons are now listed as endangered since only less than 1,400 adult dragons remain in the world. Now, how to survive Komodo dragon attack. 1. Join a group. When a Komodo dragon hunts, it looks for an easy target one that is alone. So when you go on a tour see these heavy lizards, be sure to stay with other individuals or with your group all the time. If you plan to go to Komodo National Park, you may request a park ranger or join a group tour. Remember the more in your group, the less are the dangers of a Komodo dragon attack. 2. Stay on the designated path. Stay on the park's designated walking paths. Official trekking areas tend to have high foot traffic, which Komodo dragons avoid. Staying along the trekking path puts you in a safer place. Also, people can help you in case of a Komodo dragon attack since you are with park rangers and other tourists. Keep in mind that these creatures hide in bushes. If you are in a dangerous area and do not notice them, they will likely attack you. 3. Keep safe distance. Being too close to Komodo dragons will make them feel intimidated and frightened. In effect, they might strike you. So keep your distance, and do not even attempt to go near them. You may view the Komodo dragons from afar. But keep a respectful distance and avoid getting their attention. 4. Avoid making sudden movements. Even if you are far from the Komodo dragons, move deliberately, steadily, and slowly. Quick movements can disturb Komodo dragons and stimulate a response from them. Noises and actions can make them defensive and trigger their hunting instincts. So try to be still or take calculated footsteps if you do not wish to ignite an attack. 5. Do not attract attention to yourself. Did you know that Komodo dragons have a strong sense of smell? So avoid wearing intense perfumes when visiting these mighty lizards. Do not even attempt to put a cologne in your bag. Furthermore, prevent yourself from getting injuries, as the Komodo dragons can smell blood. The smell of blood triggers them to attack and think it comes from a potential victim. So if you have open wounds or a period, avoid going near the dragons. 6. Do a zigzag run. If an aggressive dragon runs after you, do your best to outrun it. Komodo dragons can run up to 13 miles per hour. Yes, that is a bit fast. But the good news is that they cannot run that fast for long. So the key to surviving a Komodo dragon attack is to keep running. If you cannot run fast, do not worry. The dragon might get close to you, but you can still outrun it if you give everything you've got. Komodo dragons only run in a straight pattern. Changing directions is challenging for them. Doing a zigzag run back and forth will make it hard for them to chase you and stop them. 7. Climb the stairs. If you see huts or stilt houses with stairs, use the stairs and remain there until the dragons pass by. Komodo dragons do not know how to walk up the stairs, so you are safe if you stay on a higher floor. But, do not try to get away by climbing a tree. Young Komodo dragons live in trees to keep themselves safe from predators. So you may survive an attack from an adult dragon, but you might get in trouble with a baby Komodo by staying up in a tree. 8. Beat it off. If a Komodo dragon attacks you, 
use your force to fight it off. But, its scales are armor-like, so it might not feel anything if you punch or hit its body. So use a rock or a tree branch instead to ward it off. Target its mouth, eyes, or nostrils, especially if you notice that it is about to bite you. 9. Seek immediate medical attention. If a Komodo bites you, calling for help must be your number one priority. It does not matter if the bite is big or small. As Komodo dragons have venomous and fatal bites, do not waste your time. Komodo dragon bites can lead to blood thinning and poisoning, making you bleed for one to two days. So the sooner you get medical attention, the higher your chances of survival. As a team, we would appreciate if you like, subscribe and share this video clip, so as to enlighten your friends and families. Thank you for keeping up with us, we hope to see you again.